Hello and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to talk about Roman geographers. So Romans had carried forward the Greek tradition of contributions in the development of the field of geography. Both historical as well as regional geography were developed and had showed considerable progress with contributions from scholars like Strabo and Ptolemy. Strabo had huge contributions in the field of geography. He was born south of Black Sea in a Turkish town called Amisia, which was the capital of barbarian kings. This part of the kingdom had large Greek population. Now the main contributions of Strabo was his attempt to bring all the existing geographical knowledge in the form of a treatise. Strabo had written a 17-volume treatise which was titled as Geography. It was an encyclopedia and had a huge description and comprehensive work on the natural features of the earth's surface as well as settlements and cultural practices and geography. Strabo's treatise was a huge source of knowledge, especially in the Middle Ages and were referred to by several other contemporary scholars. Ptolemy was a Greek astronomer, geographer, theologist, as well as astrologer and mathematician of the 2nd century AD. His famous work is called as Geography, which is a comprehensive description of the world. Geography is an extensive and comprehensive work of Ptolemy which describes the natural features of the earth, the settlements, as well as various kinds of natural resources, climatic conditions, and cultural practices. Pliny the Elder was a Roman naturalist, geographer, author, and naval officer of the 1st century CE. His work is called as Natural History. Natural History was a monumental encyclopedia about the natural world. It also provides a detailed description about all the natural physical features, settlements, human geography, cultural features and practices, especially of the Mediterranean region. Pliny had died while saving people as a naval officer during the volcanic eruption of Mount Vesuvius. He had also a huge contribution in the field of volcanicity. Marcus Vipsanius Agrippa was a Roman general and statesman. He lived in the 1st century CE. He had constructed a very famous map of the world. He was a great cartographer and he was known for his accuracy and level of detailing in a map. His work is known as Commentary Di Bello Gallico, which is a detailed account of geography and the culture of Gaul that was the modern day France of that time. Another important scholar is Marcus Terentius Varro. He was a Roman scholar, writer, statesman of the 1st century BCE. He had many wide interests and also huge contributions in the field of agriculture, architecture, philosophy and linguistics. His major contributions were that he had classified geography into two parts, natural geography including all the natural features like mountains, rivers, valleys etc. and human geography which focuses on anthropogenetic geography like settlements, culture and social organizations.